Hey everyone, I hope you're well. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Seppi and welcome back to my annual family Christmas dinner vlog. As per like most of my vlogs, it's not like my usual family Christmas dinner. Unfortunately, Sol is working today, so my first shout out goes to Sol, my colleagues, and every other person working right now in the NHS and in general all the people who are working hard today on Christmas Day thank you so much for everything that you do and I'm sending so much love to you guys so I did my makeup really cute today we're actually having Christmas lunch so late it's like four o'clock it's dark we've never ever had it when it's dark out um, but Sino and I were really lazy and we slept in but look at my makeup so like I actually made such an effort with this makeup look at my eyes so I use like the Fenty pa um, palette Sol got me I think last year or the year before for Christmas to like do like a greeny kind of eye makeup and that is to match my outfit. So let me show you my outfit. This is my outfit. Let me try and step back so you can get all of it. This is my outfit. I have paired it with my Christian Louboutins which are like glittery and the set is from Fashion Nova um, which I really like and I need to, I basically need to take a picture before I eat because otherwise my stomach is not going to look flattering in this outfit at all. Um, also I've realised like this year I'm looking at like Instagram stories and like so many people like are not with their families or they have Covid or they're just not feeling themselves and I just think even me like this isn't a normal Christmas for me but um, I just want to send so much love and prayers with, to all of you guys and I want to wish you guys an incredible day and also a great start to the next year um, and I hope that you all stay positive and healthy and yeah so let's get started with this vlog so this is our Christmas tree for the year and we finally have all the presents underneath it Sina's has bought some little fun games for us to play and I actually like the decoration she did the only thing that I hate about this tree is the lights. I literally feel like next year we need to get new lights because every year all I think about is how much I dislike the lights. But other than that, I think it's such a beautiful decoration. It's not even that I don't like the lights, it's that I just wish it would stay on the red and yellow setting to match the theme of the tree. But yeah, so exciting. So the other thing that I always wonder is when do you guys open your presents? So the order in my family is that we wake up we have lunch because we all wake up, wake up quite late because usually the night before we go to like the local pub or whatever like we have people around for drinks obviously that didn't happen this year but traditionally that's what we do so we wake up and then we have lunch and then after lunch we sit down and open our presents and then after we've opened our presents and we're still probably feeling sickly for we then go and have dessert so I kind of want to know what does everyone do like what's your order um I've always just wondered that because I see a lot of people open their gifts first thing in the morning and then like but what do you have to look forward to throughout the day after you've eaten? I don't know, that's just my mentality. So let me know what you think. Dad? Yes? Why are you wearing red? Because your mom wearing red. Ah, because every year you wear pink and you always get a stain on it. So yes, I wanted you to wear- I change it with the pink. Yeah, I think you need to wear pink as well because otherwise it just won't be you Thank at Christmas. You. you look very pretty. Thank you, dear. Hello, beauty. <laughs> also, traditionally, everyone in my family has to hang a bauble, and I haven't hung mine yet. My mum is like having a go at me, so let me just do that now. Oh, where do I put it? Where do I put it? This tree is already so full. Oh, here we go. Oops. Oh well. No one's gonna notice that, apart from you guys now. <laughs> Mom, say me? hi to my vlog. Oh, hello, everybody. Show them your dress. Merry Christmas! Thank you! It's the most <laughs> wonderful time! Thank you! Merry Christmas to all of you! <laughs> and I hope always healthy and long, nice live! <laughs> no place to go Where snow lives, snow lives home Good night! Good night! Let me show you what you're What are you doing? Are you doing? No. Oh, 
Don't put it on the cheese board, are you mad? Sainam, she made the cheese board. It's really, really fantastic. It's not with Nutella though. No, it's not with Nutella. It's basically, this is my cheese board, guys. So my mum's come to... Ta-da! Look. Wow. It's all been sponsored by Marks and Spencers. When I say sponsored, I mean I paid for it. <laughs> Dad, why is Rocky not in his Christmas outfit? Rocky! Oh, the... oh you changed to a pink shirt! Oh, I told him you can't, like, it can't be Christmas if he's not in a pink shirt. <laughs> Bad job, Ben Azad a man. Sussy needs to do a Christmas song. I'm not even joking. Mummy Ben Christmas tradition. My dad is already asleep on the sofa after Christmas lunch. <laughs> there we go. It wouldn't be Christmas if he wasn't here asleep. So are you guys ready to open the presents? Yes. Ooh, these are all the presents. Oh, Christmas tree. Oh, Christmas tree. Been wondering just what you mean to me. Oh, Christmas tree. Honestly, it's never been much about you.
guys, I didn't tell you something. So in my previous vlog, you know how Sol and I went Secret Santa shopping? She told me she is Sina's Secret Santa. So she made me pick out um, a gift for Sina. And I was really selfless and picked her something that I really like. So you guys saw me like unbox and you saw the gift, but this is literally like something that I absolutely love. I am obsessed with the new Dior. And I love the whole saddle shape. And she got me the card holder. Let me show you the inside. So this is the inside of it. It fits like so many different cards. And it's got space on the back. And I am just beyond obsessed. Like I love this so much. I always get a new card holder like every one or two years. And it's been two years since I got my last one. So this came in perfect timing. I'm such a card holder gal. Anyone who knows me. I don't really have cash or like I don't carry like coins or anything so like card holders are the ideal gift for me so I love you so much Sol so then my mum handed me um, the gift because Sol's obviously at work um, she was like this was actually for you so I was very shocked and I love it she also got me so she also got me this bag of um, goodies so the actual bag itself is from Benefit so um, she got me this Zoeva this Zoeva mini palette um, the Hula bronzer, which is like an OG bronzer, and um, these colours. Those are the colours for my shellac, and then Sina also got me a set of shellac colours. So hopefully, even though I can't wear nail polish at work, I will have a very nice pedicure under my tight. I love all my gifts. I'm so grateful. I love everything, and I, I know that this year isn't like a typical Christmas. Nothing's normal about it. To be honest, it doesn't feel like Christmas. It feels like a very weird party. That's how I can explain it. It doesn't feel like Christmas um, because Sol's not here. But nonetheless, I'm very grateful for everything and for everyone. And I'm sending you guys all so much love. And also, these gifts weren't my way of bragging. I know that so many people can't get presents this year or can't afford anything uh, or can't afford the things that they might have the previous year or just in general. Tough times are around for all of us, and I'm very sorry if it seemed like I was showing off. I'm absolutely not. Um, but I love you guys so much, and I just wanted to share what I got for the people who want to see and are interested in seeing every year because you guys watch my Christmas vlogs. Um, my secret Santa was my mum, so you guys saw what I got her there as well. Anyway, now I am dressed in my Christmas jumper, so we are going to have dessert and more drinks. I've been having mimosas the whole time, so... Let Christmas continue. Guys, I can't cope. How cute is my little Santa? Oh my god. Mush. Hushkin. Bus. I'm so excited because the best part of the day is about to come. After presents, it's always to so. For you or for me? Mm. Sina, what is for dessert? Right, it's sticky toffee pudding. Oh god! And kush masters, it's so yummy. And um, bread and butter pudding. So bread and butter pudding and sticky toffee pudding. So I was in charge. But who chose it? Just be real. Seppi chose it. I had to call her, but I was in charge of getting all I this I just want to put it out there. She went to M&S and bought the desserts that I buy every year, so. Yeah, but I called you and asked you. I called her and I said, Seppi, what should I get? What should I get? Because I really couldn't, I was like, I didn't know what to get because I didn't want Seppi to be like, oh, I don't like what you got. So I was like, what do also, I Also, where's your outfit from? This dress is from Motel. I bought a red dress and when I wore it, I was like, I've seen this dress before. And don't say, it's identical to mummy's red dress <laughs> that she loves so much. And I was like, I can't wear this. It looks like I'm wearing the same dress. So I wore this one, but I love it. It's so, so cute. cute. I love, when did you get this? It's from Motel. I just got it new. It's brand new. Really? I haven't shopped from Motel in such a long time. But I've never eaten give Sina a kiss to say thank you for the dessert. He's eating the dessert. Come mm. and see the dessert. He bought me the best Christmas present, you guys. He was my secret Santa. What did he get you? And he got basically, I didn't even knew who my secret Santa was. I didn't even knew who my secret Santa was. So I was like, where is my secret Santa? I want this, 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 this. And he went and bought it. Sign us like a sign us a kid. She knows exactly what she wants. She knows exactly what she wants. <laughs> yeah. And she really wanted noise cancelling at first. Man, I'm literally like a kid, huh? But I'm just I always 
say exactly what I want for Christmas. My Christmas gift was the best. Love you so. Shout out if you're watching. Wait, what? <laughs> I just want to say that so you're a bitch because I'm sorry, but I want a Dior bloody purse and I don't want the nail polish. I'll change it with the purse. <laughs> no, I love the nail polish. Yeah. Wow. for all this dessert? Yes, it is. <laughs> yeah. You didn't yes, answer my I question. <laughs> You're distracted. It's very, very, very nice. He just I woke up from his nap. Part of the <laughs> so my room is looking like really clean, but lol, there is a TV in the middle of it. Don't mind that. I've just come out of the shower, lol. I'm going to put a face mask on. Hold on, I will show you which one. Don't... Watch how messy this is, by the way. So, I think I'm gonna do this one the ultra moisturizing and brightening one by Sephora in Lychee. Actually, my skin's feeling really sensitive. I think I'm gonna go for this one instead. It is the nourishing and smoothing. So, I'm going to put on this Sephora face mask. It is the coconut nourishing and smoothing mask. And my skin is really broken out right now. It's awful. I've just come out the shower. Um, but yeah, I want to put this on. I really want a new exfoliating scrub and like I don't know if you guys can relate But you know when you're like I can't even remember what I used to use as an exfoliator like my mind's gone blank But like I remember I used to have like loads of face washes and face scrubs and I used to really enjoy my exfoliator And I just cannot remember for the life of me what it was So if you guys have any oh my god all the juices are like coming out of this if You guys have any recommendations then like do please let me know because I am in the market for one and especially now with all the sales happening, it will be the perfect time to buy one. I also saw the Summer Fridays jet lag mask. Sorry, my dad is always like telling his stories loud and with excitement, if you can hear that. Um, yeah, anyway, going back to what I was saying, the Summer Fridays jet lag mask, I saw the super size one for sale with like 30% off um, on Netta Porter. And I've heard loads of people like rave about it, but um, I don't know like, what it's for basically like is it like a daily is it a weekly is it like to clear out skin what like what is it for like i don't i just yeah so if someone knows if it's good let me know but for an exfoliating scrub kind of wash please give me your recommendations i am on the market oh my god why am i finding it so difficult to get this face mask oh yeah there we go so i'm gonna pop this on and then I'm going to pop some TV on. The reason why, by the way, there is a TV in the middle of my room is because... Oh my god, I actually can't take myself seriously. Ugh. This feels so nice and cool, though. I'm not even going to lie to you guys. Oh no, is the nose bit stuck underneath? Oh, I don't really care. So yeah, going back. So the reason why... Oh, this feels so nice. The reason why there is a TV in the middle of my room is because I haven't decided I want to move the furniture around in my bedroom a little bit and I haven't decided where to put it but I wanted a TV in my room because I've never ever had one and I spent some time in Sina's room like living in her room for a week um, about a month ago and one thing I really found that I loved was her TV in her room so I was like okay I really need one so that is why we have come to the conclusion kids I'm basically Things with one of those people with a TV in their room, which I never thought I'd be, and I always thought was bad, and I will never allow for my kids. But um, so yeah, Netflix recommendations hit me up. I'm gonna come back to say bye to you once this is off because I just cannot like leave this video looking so hideous. We are adding to the skincare with water and lemon. I and no, I don't drink enough water. Oh my god, I actually can't. I'm gonna come back to you when this is off because I just can't deal with myself right now. So this is the mask off, oh my god. Sorry, downstairs is a whole debate going on about if going outside in the cold will make you catch a cold. Like, are you more likely to catch a cold going out in the cold, which is such an Iranian topic. But anyway. That was so unsexy of me. Anyway, I'm gonna end this vlog here. I hope you guys have enjoyed my annual Christmas vlog. It's a real shame. 
Actually, I have one more thing to show you before I end the vlog. So, I actually got some more Christmas presents that I want to show you guys. Um, that I got like before under the tree. So first up was these trainers. They are from Nike and they are so cute and pretty. I love them. They're for running. I have recently really got into running so I thought this was such a thoughtful gift. And I really wanted new running trainers so I'm so happy about that. Um, and then these weren't technically gifts from people but from the brand so thank you public desire um they sent me a couple pairs of shoes for christmas and the first one Sina is literally obsessed with it is these pair of boots which i was contemplating wearing on christmas day with like a white t-shirt like a white designer t-shirt style and these boots um yeah super sexy but then i decided like if i got tired and took off my shoes i'd be spending christmas day in a t-shirt and that's just not my style um so yeah decided against that but you guys will probably see that outfit drip on the gram soon and then the last pair of shoes i got also from public desire are these boots i thought they'd be so perfect for work look at that they're so cute and they've got like this metal tip toe which I absolutely love. Sign is like, there's no way you're gonna be able to wear this to work, like your feet are gonna die. But I really wanna try it. The only problem with my work is the car park is an absolute, what can I say, construction site is really the best way to put it. Like it's got flooding everywhere. So I'd probably need to like take shoes and then change into this, which seems like so much effort, but I am that kind of gal. Like I am that guy, you know, who like would go that extra mile to wear these shoes that no one will probably notice. Anyway might be coming to a ward near you soon um so yes that is all my christmas presents which i am so grateful for i'm going to end this vlog here hope you guys have enjoyed my annual christmas vlog if you did then don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up subscribe down below watch the old christmas videos and compare to what life was like before covid came along and ruined our celebrations lol joke um but anyway seriously real talks so don't forget to check out my socials they're always linked down below my instagram is persian bunny my snap is seppi samoy i don't usually look like this i look very different you might think i'm a catfish up to you to decide go and check it out um and my clinic's instagram is dr s aesthetics love you guys so much and i'll see you next time bye